Ciao. Jira Tall got me pregnant. <laughs> Let me explain. Geritol got me pregnant. Seriously. I don't doubt it for a moment that taking Geritol for two months contribute to me conceiving my first child at the age of 40. But it's truthful. I'm currently 16 weeks and three days pregnant in my second trimester. Um, I have PCOS. And endometrial, endome. Get this together, and I mean now. Get this together, ho. You're acting too slow. Endometriosis, as well. So I knew that it was going to be a hard time for me to get pregnant. I knew that we, my boyfriend and I, were. We just felt like we knew we were going to have to take some type of, or have some type of assistance for conceiving our child because my cycles are irregular. I may have three to four cycles a year. Ain't nobody got time for that. And me being the age of 40 um, would be even harder for me to try to conceive on our own. But we did. And so how everything went about was I was mainly trying to um, find some remedy for growing my hair back stronger and faster because I had recently relaxed my hair in July. And when I relaxed my hair in July, I was like, okay, it's thinner. Well, you all know because of the relaxer. So I came across this YouTuber. Okay, so how I went from this to this. She used Geritol. I watched the video. Okay, so the first pick was in early 2021. And then this pick right here was in late 2021. So I grew my hair back in less than a year. Um, so I did take Geritol. And y'all be killing me with these comments. But, um... Geritol, it comes in the peel form and it comes in the liquid form. So the liquid form is disgusting. <laughs> I just can't stomach it. People say that it works a lot faster and it just has like, it's a multi, it's basically just a multivitamin. Okay. So, but it has like a lot of nutrition that your body needs. So people say that it's for old people, but honestly it's for anyone who is like lacking the nutrition that you need. I ordered a Geritol, came two bottles in a box, and at the end of the last week of July is when I start taking Geritol constantly, every day, as recommended by the dosage. And so, um, in September, first week of September around, I guess I found out September 8th, that I was having like, I was very tired, my breasts were extremely sore, and I was sleeping all day, every day, even at work. Don't tell anyone. But um, I decided to take a pregnancy test September the 8th that morning because I wanted to start taking my red um, leaf raspberry tea. And I always take that, but I always take a pregnancy test just, you know, just to clear my mind and say, okay, you know, nothing there. Let's go ahead with the procedure because I have really bad cramps. And so I took the pregnancy test. I got my day started. I left it on the counter in the bathroom. An hour into work, I come back. Let me check on this. It pops up pregnant. <laughs> yes, pregnant. I could not believe it. Um, I went crazy. <laughs> I just could not believe that I got pregnant that easily. We were, we knew for sure we were gonna need medical assistance, but so happened we didn't. And so that was my story. Um, I believe Geritol contributes to a lot of women getting pregnant. Everyone keeps saying, you know, at the end of every bottle is a baby. I believe it. So even though the doctors cannot confirm it, I turned 40 this year. God, you look so good. I know I'm looking good. But um, we really wanted a child. I knew I was going to be a mother. I just didn't know when. I always knew that I was either going to adopt or um, have some medical assistance with me trying to conceive on my own. But the Lord works in mysterious ways. He definitely worked for me because I'm 40 years old. I'm pregnant with my first child. I'm in my second trimester. I'm due May 20th next year. I will be 41 by then. And so, um, 
there's a lot of women especially black women um popping up pregnant later in life very pregnant <laughs> and to think i almost missed out on motherhood because i thought i was too old and so i believe that you know it's just god's timing but i do believe he did steer me into the right direction by um putting a youtuber who was on tiktok and now when you go through the comments everyone's talking about how they got pregnant oh damn so that's just my story um i hope you consider geritol part of your supplement regimen and you know um hopefully it works out if you especially if you're trying to conceive i did eat healthy i did work out so those things contribute stop eating fast food um a lot of the things that kind of de are detrimental to you trying to get pregnant i didn't do that and so i do contribute healthy diet exercising even if it's just walking and geritol um as part of the reason why i got pregnant so stay tuned for more because I want to talk about the supplements I use while I'm pregnant and my decision to cut my hair off and go back natural because for obvious reasons, um, having a relaxer while you're pregnant is not healthy. At least that's what I was told. But um, yeah, so thank you for tuning in, watching, listening, hearing me ramble on. I just believe that this is just like a miracle that I was able to conceive. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. Um, off of Geritol, getting pregnant. And only having four cycles a year and all those other things that kind of, you know, um, kind of hamper the women's ability to get pregnant naturally on her own. Um, but thanks a lot for tuning in. Stay tuned for more. Thank you. Life with Miss Dana. Bye.